In today's BizBeat, we will break down China's latest trade figures. In the first five months, imports and exports increased by 4.7% year-on-year, totaling 16.7 trillion yuan, achieving a steady growth. The import and export of private enterprises maintained good growth momentum. From the perspective of market entities in the first five months of this year, there were 439,000 private companies with import and export performance, an increase of 8.8% year-on-year, with a total import and export of 8.9 trillion yuan, an increase of more than 13% year-on-year, and continued to maintain the position of China's largest foreign trade business entity. Emerging markets are becoming a new growth point for China's foreign trade. ASEAN continued to be China's largest trading partner in the first five months of this year. With overall trade between the two sides totaling close to 2.6 trillion yuan, an year-on-year -year increase of nearly 10%, accounting for 15.4% of China's total foreign trade. Imports and exports to countries along the Belt and Road reached 5.8 trillion yuan, a year-on-year -year increase of 13%, of which Kazakhstan and other five Central Asian countries increased by 44%. The import and export to other RCEP members was 5.1 trillion yuan, a year-on-year -year increase of 4.5%. Analysts say that the stable growth of China's foreign trade is inseparable from the continuous promotion of high-level opening up and the continuous introduction of measures to stabilize foreign trade. As the RCEP takes full effect, new opportunities continue to emerge. Recently, new policies and measures have been introduced from the state to the local level to promote stable scale and optimize structure of foreign trade, which has opened up new development space for foreign trade companies and will strongly promote the stability and quality of foreign trade throughout the year.